Hello fellow Sudokans and welcome to Zen and the Art of the Guardian Sudoku Puzzle. It's Saturday the 15th of April 2023. I hope you are keeping well. Uh, it's a slightly overcast day here in Bangkok. That means the temperature is a bit lower than uh, the last couple of days, which will be nice for water throwing fun. Today is our last day of that. Uh, not sure I'm going to be able to do that though. Um, um, I've just dropped my cat off at the animal hospital again. The poor thing is not having a good new year. Uh, but it is a regular treatment for him. I was wondering if the hospital will be open. Um, it was, and uh, that's good. Uh, but I see they were on a depleted staff. Uh, normally, they have half a dozen receptionists. Give you an idea about how fancy this animal hospital is. I told you, it's, I've mentioned it before. It's fancier than a human hospital in many regards. They have six people behind the reception desk, usually when you walk in. <laughs> but today, they only had two. Uh, but they know me very well, and so they just said, are you going to leave Joni here? And I said, yes, I am. Okay, I'll be back later. So I'll, I'm waiting. I've dropped him off, and I'll be waiting for the telephone call from the vet. I wonder which vet is on today, though, because I suspect that not all of the vets will be working, and there's definitely a, an unequal amount of skill in, uh, um, in this particular place. Some vets are wonderful. Some are less excellent and do a slightly... Uh, um, the job they do is not quite as good, um, but no choice really. So uh, that's that. I was hoping, uh, and fortunately for me, um, the cat didn't get wet. Uh, there was a chance because although I can go from my home to the place in, in, in the car, of course, which uh, is not going to get wet, the, the car park for this animal hospital is not just outside. It has to be quite some uh, distance away. It's a few hundred meters away. Uh, where they have their own private car park. And that means you have to sit in a golf cart to be transported from your vehicle back to the animal hospital. And I was expecting uh, that I might get wet, but actually there weren't any people out and playing uh, with the water uh, just yet. But it's still only just lunchtime here, so maybe later there will be. We'll see. All right, let's get on with this game because I can see, uh, I, I think, two things. I can certainly see one thing and I, possibly two. So I see the nines blocking across here, and that's going to give me a nine up here. This, of course, is New York Times hard level uh, Sudoku puzzle. Uh, and we have two blocking across here like this. That's going to give me a two there. What's missing here? Uh, three, six, seven. We've got a seven, a three, and a six. I don't know about just yet. Um, those nines, I thought I'd seen something else, but I could have been dreaming. Ah, uh, yes, I was dreaming. Okay, anything else on these twos? Not sure. I'll notice anything. Um... Uh, shall we have a quick look through? So obviously we have ones here and here. Uh, anything else useful? I'm not sure. Twos are somewhere up there. Uh, I'm not sure what else is useful down here. Four. What was up there? Fours there. Fours. Oh, threes. Ah, sixes block across here like this. <laughs> yes, I know I'm highlighting three and talking about six, but that's the way the Sudoku cookie crumbles. So three is along like this. Uh, I'm not sure anything else much. Okay, so we have a pair of sixes over here. Uh, 
of sevens there. Ah, seven down here, seven across here, and across here. So there's our seven, seven up here, seven down here. Seven is one of our missing numbers here, blocking back that way, seven across here. So there's another seven for us. Okay, eight and nine block down here. Eight and nine are across these two rows. So we have ourselves a pair of eight and nine in these two squares. Let's hope it means something useful. I'm not sure it will, but let's see. Uh, what do we know then? So eight and nine are here. What do we know about ones? We already know that ones are in these two squares. So uh, nothing new there. Ones, ones are also up there. Uh, do we know anything about the threes? Block across the middle, so we've got threes, threes in these squares. We've got ones here, we've got threes there. Fours, like that. And fives like that. I don't know, I'm not getting very far here, I think. Uh, I forgot what this was. This was, ah, this was, oh, okay. Right, this was eight and nine, wasn't it? So now we've got six blocking up here and six is one of our numbers missing from here. So that in fact is a six. And now I think, so uh, what did I just find before? Eight, nine. Okay, so we have four blocking across here and four. No, that's not going to matter. Still four there. <laughs> Excuse me. Hmm. Um, I wonder if I should check out the rest of this row. This this is eight and nine, so missing here is three, four, six, yes. So we've got the six blocking here and the six blocking here. So there's our six. And then we will have three and four in those squares. Still to be determined, I think. Uh, how about that six? Six up here and up here and across here. That gives me another six there. Six across and across here and one up there. Means that that's a six, six down, six up. That will give me a six here. I forgot what was missing. Seven and something. Seven blocks up here. Seven. What's the other thing? Three. Um, so sevens will be in those squares. Don't know anything else. Threes. Uh, not sure. Uh, we've got three. Okay, threes are in these squares, aren't they? Um, so threes are in these squares. Uh, so it puts three in those squares down there. Well, oh, six is finished. Um, all right, what's missing across here? One, four, five. Something else we know, fours have to be up here because we've got four limited to these squares here. Fours are there. And I said fours are in those squares, so up here, no, can't really do much. Uh, 
What's missing from here? One, five, eight. Got a one and an eight. So one, five, eight here. Uh, do we know anything about the twos? No. The threes? No. The fours are here. And the sevens are over here. Oh, no, I thought I'd found some. I thought I had one, two, four, eight, nine here, but that's not correct, is it? One, two, four, it is correct. One, two, four, eight, nine. But that means that could be one or two. Not. I thought I'd found the rest of the numbers here, but I had not. So forget that, cancel that idea. That's going nowhere. Uh, I think I'm just going to hit on the digits and see what looks good. What do I know? I know ones are up here. I know ones are here. Um, I know ones are over there and over there. Ah, okay. So we've got one blocking here. W one appears in one of those squares there, blocking that square. One blocking here. So we get ourselves a one in this square now.
Sorry, but this game is taking a long time. I should be heading to the pencil marks very shortly, I think, because it's just taking too long to find. I don't have an inexhaustible supply of time for these videos uh, because everybody will just switch off and I won't get any views and some people will just be falling asleep as well. So... Okay, let's point some candidates, shall we? Now, I said earlier on that this was 8 and 9. I better do that first. And I know that this uh, is 3s in those squares. And I know that 1s appear in these squares. Since I know that, I know 1s are up here as well. Uh, now, we have 4 blocking across here and up here. So we have 4s in those squares. And then the 5s we have blocking along here. Uh, like this and something else about the fives wasn't there ah oh, it's worse than I thought fives are possible in three locations I thought I'd limited to uh, am I daydreaming so it looks like fives are possible there I thought I had a pair of fives here and here or something, did I? I guess I'll find out later if I'm making a mistake. Anyway, let's see. Uh, we definitely have a pair of fours in those squares there. And we have a pair of fours here, which is gonna put four up there. And we have fours there as well. Down here we have one blocking down here, that's going to put ones there. We're going to have ones up there. We're going to have eights in these squares and seven, no, not sevens, uh, nines. I th No, not nines. Damn, what's missing? Uh, fives, sorry, in all of those squares. Um, we have sevens in those squares, I remember. We have sevens down here. Uh, right, let's do it properly then. So what do we know about ones? They are a pair in those squares. And that's about it. Twos are somewhere across there. Threes here, threes down there. Okay, so I think that's it for pairs then. Um, so I only managed to get two numbers up here, not three numbers. That's a shame. Uh, so, oh, I've got to put a seven there. Excuse me. Sorry. Um, still only two numbers in those squares, though. All right, let's get on with it. Fill up the rest. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. This is complete over here. One, two, three blocks across here and three blocks up here. So we get threes in those squares. Four is in five blocks across here like this. So five in those squares. Six, seven, uh, eight and nine are done. I'm sure there's nothing across here I can do. No, nope, three, four, eight, nine. I knew that already. Okay, so let's come down here. There is one digit missing. We're missing a two. Let's put that in. Uh, we will do this up here. We are missing twos in these squares. And we are missing one more number. What, are, what is it? What is it? Three, isn't it? Three in also in those squares up there. 
And I think that's done. Two, three, four, seven, yes. Uh, right, so does it matter anywhere now? I'm not sure. Let's just go along the top. One. No, let's go down here instead. Uh, one. What do you know about twos? Do we know anything about twos? I don't think we do. Three, four, five blocks across here. Eight blocks like this. And nine blocks like this. Uh, don't know which way. Let's go across this way. Two can go anywhere here. Five across here. Eight across the bottom. And nine across the middle. Okay, let's have a look. Uh, I don't spot anything, so I've got to move up to the top. Uh, we've got one blocking across here, so one in those squares there. We have two blocking up here. Okay, two's in those squares. Give me a three. We have three blocking up here, so we put threes in those squares. Do we know anything about four? Four blocks up here, so fours go there. What about five? Uh, no, don't know anything about fives. Everything else is done. Let's have a look now. I might have to put my glasses on. It's not very clear. Let's finish it off. There might be something easy up here. Uh, what do we about two? Nothing. What do we know about three? That it blocks up here. What do we know about four? It's already done. What do we know about five? Not much. Eight, blocking across and up here. Oh, good grief. Look at that. We've had a nine all this time. <laughs> okay, so this is not a nine down here then. Uh, okay, so I probably need to reevaluate everything now. <laughs> I didn't realize there was an easy one there. Uh, but still, I think that's still pretty reasonable shape anyway. <laughs> um, let's see. Anything else we can do right now with the ones? Not sure. Twos. Okay, so we've got one, two, and five in these squares. So this is not two or five, it must be a four. And this is not two, five, or four, it must be a seven. So that puts a seven into that square, which will be the last seven. Let's get rid of candidate seven there.
This now must be a five since we've got four over here already. Let's get rid of all of these fives, shall we? And that's going to put a, a three into that square, a four into that square, and then we're left with an eight over here. Uh, and we'll get rid of these candid eights. Two, three, two, three, okay. Can't have threes there anymore. Three must be in this square. Let's remove all of those threes. That will give us a two here, a five there. Uh, a one here, a five there. Get rid of those fives. And we got the two already, so that will be an eight. And this must be three. So we will get rid of the, well, let's just put the two there first of all, then the four there. And the one over here, which puts one into that square there. So let's get rid of some ones. Got two and three here. This is the only space for a four now. Four must go there. This must be a five then. So four is here. Four's in that square. Let's get rid of the candidate four there. And here, let's place a three. Three, two. This is a one. One down here, one up there. Uh, two, three, two, three, so five, eight, five, eight, okay. Uh, five blocks this square, so in this row, that's the only space a five can be. So five is in that square, two is in that square, two is down here. And uh, two also blocks across here like this, so we'll get rid of all of these candidate twos. Okay. Uh, now we have five here, so this has to be an eight, giving us nine in this square, eight in that square. Nine goes here, eight is here. Get rid of the eights. Let's get rid of the nines down here. That nine means that nine goes here, two is in that square. Two up here means that two goes over here, and this will be a three. Three means that this will be a five, and this will be a three. So it took me a long time to get there, uh, but I did eventually. And as always, I say, this is not a notation-free channel, and I will just get you to the end some way or another. See ya. Bye-bye.